cascade of cancellations. A number of car auctions pulling the plug following the announcement that the Pebble Beach Concorde de Elegance will not happen this year. Cities are now looking at millions of dollars in lost revenues. Action News reporter Christopher Salas joins us now with more. Well, Aaron, I had a chance to speak with the CEO of Russo and Steel tonight, and he told me he was completely shocked by the decision to cancel the Concorde d'Elegance. And he said that event is the anchor of Car Week. And without that, they had no choice but to cancel. The city of Monterey slamming the brakes on Car Week. The good news in this is we now know for certain that Car Week was canceled and we can focus on that worst case scenario. Three major auctions, RM Sotheby's, Russo and Steel, and Meekums, all announcing they won't be coming to Monterey in 2020. This just a day after the Pebble Beach Concorde d'Elegance also canceled due to COVID-19. Unfortunately, with the cancellation of the Concourse de Elegance, uh, the other auction houses were, were basically following suit. The city was hoping Car Week would give them a head start in the new fiscal year. Now, they'll be looking at a shortfall of 2 to $3 million in just occupancy tax. This is a real blow to the local economy. The Quail and most of the major events in Pacific Grove also called off months in advance. An estimated loss of 4 to $5 million. But some events are waiting to make a decision down the road. We're still assessing the situation of whether we, you know, how we change the event or whether we continue the event or cancel the event. WeatherTech Raceway Laguna Seca says they're not only hoping to continue with Car Week events like the reunion, pre-reunion and the kickoff, but for now, their season opening races in July have the green light. What that looks like, how many entries they would have, uh, whether it would be a closed off to spectators. Uh, that Those are all things that will be, I think, mandated or dictated by what happens in Sacramento. We want to awaken the business community again. You know, Monterey Car Week is so uh, so important to the local restaurants, the shops, the hotels. If there's a way that we can hold the, the event in some form or fashion, we, we, we really want to do that. And Monterey City Manager told me tonight they're going to have to go back to the drawing board when it comes to next fiscal year's budget. He said, Aaron, they're planning on representing it to the council early May, beginning of June. This obviously changes a lot of things. Hard to overstate the impact, the huge economic impact on the Monterey Peninsula. Absolutely. All right. Thank you, Christopher.